Less than two hours ago, South Korea successfully put into orbit its first domestically made Earth observation satellite. Our An Sung-jin explains in detail what this means. A rocket launches into space, carrying its payload from South Korea. That payload is an Earth observation nanosatellite developed by the Satellite Technology Research Center at the Korea Advanced Institute of Science and Technology. It's being taken into space by U.S. company Rocket Lab's lightweight electron orbital rocket, which was launched on Wednesday morning from Mahia, New Zealand. That rocket was also carrying an advanced composite solar sail system created by the U.S. National Aeronautics and Space Administration. Korea's nanosatellite separated from the rocket 50 minutes after launch and is set to come into contact with the Korea Aerospace Research Institute four and a half hours after launch at around noon Korean time. The satellite named Neonsat-1 is just the beginning of the South Korea's mission Beginning of the Swarm, which aims to establish a satellite constellation network by 2027 by adding 10 other satellites. Weighing less than 100 kilograms, it will be used to observe the Earth using a high-resolution optical camera from an altitude of 500 kilometers. The science ministry stated that through the satellite cluster, not only will the country be able to quickly respond to natural disasters and security threats, but it could also reduce costs needed to purchase satellite images from overseas. Starting in May 2020 and running until December 2027, the project, funded through the science ministry, will cost over 230 billion won or 168 million U.S. dollars. An Song-jin, Arirang News.